right, so I know that I am late to start because it's December 3rd, but I've always wanted to do Vlogmas and we're gonna try it out and see how far I can get. Not very good that I'm already late, but it is Wednesday, December 3rd. I have just gotten off of work and I'm actually in the parking lot of the post office. I have to return some stuff that I got from Forever 21 that didn't fit. So super exciting, right? That's just, that's what we're doing. Checking my P.O. box. See if there's anything. So I'm at CVS right now and I'm just looking at some of the stuff they have. Alright, so I was at CVS and had to leave because they just were following me around and it's funny when employees of stores like that assume that I'm going to shoplift or something like that and it's like you have no idea how much money I spend at your store buying makeup. Like I am not the one you need to worry about. And honestly, it just makes me feel really uncomfortable. I know they're just doing their job, but like a lot of times I'll just leave the stuff just because, I don't know, I just don't like having people follow me like that. It's just weird. I don't know. But um, yeah, I went to the post office. I read my, redoed my uh, PO box. And if you want to send me a letter, I'll put that down below. I'm gonna do a PO box opening really soon. Um, I'm collecting stuff for that. All right, so I just pulled up to my house. So let me show you what's waiting for me. So there's Luna. She waits for me by the window. Yes, she does. And Hugo should be over here. I don't know if you can see him because he's a little dark. Hi, Hugo. Wait and you see how excited they get. So I got, <gasps> looks like some of my Black Friday stuff came in. Wait to see if I can see if package is up. Hi, Hi, guys. Ow! Hi, Hugo. Hi, guys. This is Hugo. That's Luna. They're both rescues. What are you doing? Hi, you go. Hi, you go. Hi. 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 So first thing I do when I get home, obviously say hi to the dogs, but they love to be outside. So of course I let them out. He's like, hello. Make a run for it. And no, they don't ever fall in the canal. Luna jumped in once because she thought it would be fun to take a swim, and then she realized it was a really steep drop and she just never did it again. Okay, so last night I got a few missed calls from a number, and I don't answer numbers that I don't recognize. If it's someone that I know, I'll have their number, and if it's important enough, they'll leave a voicemail. And this person did leave a voicemail, but I didn't check it until today and I'll play it for you guys. Hey Billy, it's Scott. I'm just calling to check on you, just so you, what you posted on Facebook, I just wanna make sure you're hanging in there. It sounds like you're in a little bit of depression over there. I'm just checking on you, buddy, all right? A lot of people care about you, but you don't realize. Talk to you later, bye-bye. So Scott thinks that this phone number is for Billy, and Billy's in trouble. So, I don't know, I'm thinking of texting this person, letting them know that this isn't Billy's phone because I guess he wants to let Billy know that he cares about him and poor Billy has no idea. So, that's always kind of weird because I've had the same number since ninth grade, so it's kind of odd for someone to accidentally call me with this number. So, I am going to my job's holiday party this evening. And so last night I was trying to pick out which dress I was going to wear. That's why I have dresses back here. And I'm trying to decide if I want to go really dressed up or kind of casual because it's 
it's not really a super fancy thing. It's not like ball gowns or anything crazy like that. So I don't know. I'll show you what I'm what I'm thinking. So I was really loving this dress from Forever 21. Very simple polka dot cotton dress, but what I love is the back detail. It's got a low V in the back and it's got this cute little bow. So I was thinking that dress. But I don't know. Maybe with like a, a belt or something. Not really sure what I'm gonna what I'm gonna do. So I figured I should talk about my outfit, the earrings are from Forever 21. The top is from Target. Pants are from Urban Outfitters. Um, for the last season though, like when they did all the colored pants. I know they look pink, but they're actually a coral color. And the shoes are from Payless, which I love these, these sneakers because they have them in all different colors and patterns. And they're normally $19.99, but I actually got them on, when they were on clearance for $9. And then I had a coupon code for 20% off, so loving that. That's Luna. And Hugo is probably still outside because he loves being outside. She's a little princess. She likes to be inside, but yeah, there's Hugo. Hey, you want to come inside? So like I said, they are both rescues, and I'm super passionate about rescuing dogs. Um, Hugo was actually dumped in a field, and he was living there on his own before the rescue found him, and I adopted him. He's been the most amazing dog. Hey, yes, you are. And Luna was actually a stray. They found her on the street. She had, I guess, had run away or something like that, and... Yeah, so I rescued her from the animal shelter. So I'm usually pretty hungry when I get home, so I always like make a snack or something. And usually I'm so hungry that I can't even just like wait to make anything. So I'll just eat like an apple or something like that. I don't know. What do you guys like to eat? What kind of stuff? To, this is like an organic Granny Smith apple. I'm super strict usually when it comes to apples. I usually always get them organic just because they're one of the one of the fruits that are heavily sprayed. The other option is if you can't afford organic apples you can always get conventional apples but make sure that you peel them. Don't eat this peel. Granny Smiths are one of my favorites, but my absolute favorites are the Pink Lady Apples. I like a good tart apple. Also, I don't know if you can tell, but this apple isn't very shiny. Usually a conventional apple, they'll put like wax on it, which is basically like a layer of plastic, which is essentially plastic is made from petroleum, so very toxic. So if you go, next time you go to the supermarket, look at the conventional apples. They're usually super, super, super shiny. Like, almost like they have clear nail polish on them. Not good. I'm eat my snack and... Super exciting! Super exciting. Alright, so when I get home, put my hair in a ponytail, take off my fake earrings, and get comfy. So I put on some leggings. And also put this shirt on. This is from a Forever 21 pajama set. I'll link it if it's still available. Yeah. So I'm pretty tired, so I'm probably going to try to take a nap. I've been watching uh, American Horror Story lately, which is kind of surprising because I always avoided it because I don't watch scary movies because I tend to have really bad nightmares as it is, even without watching them. But I actually just gave it a shot and I've been hooked. It's actually not like super scary, like things popping out all the time. So you're not like jumping all the time. It's more like mentally scary as you put all the pieces together. I'm almost done with season one. So then, yeah, so I'll probably watch a little bit of that and take a little nap ski and check back in with you guys in a little bit.